Hello and welcome back to It's All Fun and Games. I am at the Long Island Retro Gaming Expo, and I am going to be covering the Shaq Fu Tournament. Shaq Fu is a game for the Sega Genesis and Super Nintendo, and it has a terrible, terrible rap. And for good reason, it's not a very good game, but we still want to cover that tournament to see why people love Shaq Fu. Is it because of Shaq himself? Is it because they have a hatred for themselves in their hearts? We don't know, so let's find out. All right, I'm here with John, and I'm here to get his thoughts about Shaq Fu. Now, Shaq Fu was a video game for the Sega Genesis and the Super Nintendo, and it featured Shaquille O'Neal, the superstar basketball player, in a fighting game. Uh, how does that sound to you? It kind of sounds like the best thing ever. You know, I love his work in commercials, but what were you thinking making a video game? Just stick to basketball and commercials. No, I'm a huge fan of Shaq Fu. Huge fan. Right, I mean, you had Mortal Kombat, Street Fighter. Um, so uh, yeah, Shaq Fu is it's not, it's not the best option. I made my way to the Room of Power for the Shaq Fu Tournament but was met with some devastating news. Yeah, the Shaq Fu tournament is canceled. How come, man? For reasons unbeknownst to me, they have canceled the tournament. And I'm gonna find out why and what people think about the cancellation of Shaq Fu. How do you feel about the cancellation of the Shaq Fu tournament? I can't believe it. Why did they cancel it? They say that the cartridges aren't working, but in a realm where there's so many cartridges floating around, I'm sure they have an extra Shaq Fu cartridge around here. I'm sure if they really wanted to, they could probably dig one up. I hope that something can come along in your life that will fill the hole that is definitely left in your heart. What a shame. What a shame. I'm here with Andy, an employee at the Retro Gaming Expo, and I gotta ask him, What's happening with the Shaq Fu tournament? Why was it canceled? What's going on? I have no idea what Shaq Fu. No, no clue. Never heard of it. Don't know anything about it. I didn't know this was what it was going to be about. I'm going to... No, come back. Come back, Andy. I thought you were here to help me out, Andrew. I am trying to help you out, man. I'm telling you about everything that's going on here. What about Shaq Fu? What about Shaq Fu? Why is the tournament not going on? I'm not sure. Did you check out Super Smash yet? Another employee covering something up. I thought my quest to bring back the Shaq Fu tournament had come to an abrupt end when none of the employees would seem to give me a straight answer. But after some searching, I had come upon an entrance that led me to the head honcho of the convention himself. All right, I'm here with the man who saved the Shaq Fu tournament. How did you do it? Well, I used my executive powers and I made it happen. That's really all it took. That's all it took. He made it happen. He just used his executive powers and made the Shaq Fu tournament happen. How many participants do we have in this year's Shaq Fu tournament? I, it was a little rough. We didn't think we could fit them all. We have two. Two people going head to head in the greatest game of all time. Shaq Fu, sudden death, one match for it all. All, all all, the money, all the prizes, which is just really a toilet trophy, but hey, it's still really cool. I'm sure you guys are going to check it out soon. Awesome. Thank you very much for saving the Shaq Fu tournament. I'm very happy to hear it's back. Shaq Fu may be one of the worst games ever, but there's no denying that sometimes a bad game can be a lot of fun when you're playing with a friend. And these two friends duked it out in a winner-take-all match that proved to be quite exciting and would have made the big Aristotle Shaq very proud. After a brilliant three-round battle, Shaq versus Shaq, we have a winner, and he is the two-time Shaq Fu champion. How does it feel? Uh, pretty good, pretty good. You know, it's uh, hard fought, and uh, it was my second time playing the game, the first being last year at the uh, similar Shaq Fu tournament. And this one was on Super Nintendo. Last year was on Sega Genesis. And also the runner-up, a gracious runner-up, two-time runner-up. Hey, 
You can't can't feel bad with that. How do you feel about this Shaq Fu tournament? It feels pretty good. You know, it feels good ramming the B button over and over. <laughs> <laughs> His plan of attack was simply to mash B. Did either of you feel a difference playing on Super Nintendo rather than the Sega Genesis? Do you feel like you were hindered in any way? No, I tried to taunt a lot and, and strategically and, and uh, stay on one side of the uh, the uh, screen. And uh, so uh, I, owe, I owe it to uh, my opponent who taught me how to play the game. Second time playing, a second time champion. Any final thoughts, final words for the great big Diesel Shack? I really think this game deserves a sequel, and uh, there was a Kickstarter campaign, and uh, I think it has to happen. I agree with that. Any words for the Diesel? Thank you. Thank you, Shack. Well, the people have spoken, and the Shack Fu tournament was put back on, and it was a rousing success. Two fierce competitors duked it out in a one-on-one -on -one Shaq versus Shaq matchup, and a winner was crowned. And I couldn't have been any more excited. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time on It's All Fun and Games.